Good morning, guys. We're back here, and welcome to another vlog. Vlog number 33, and it is July 25th, 2019, and it's 7.41. I'm early to get today. Compared to, like, the last, like, week I've been recording, uh, I'm early. Uh, feel good this morning. Got up, didn't set an alarm, which could have been bad, but I did get up on time. Well, I got up, not really on time. My alarm normally goes off at 6.35. Well, 6.45, I think. I don't remember. Some, something close to that. The six, late 6 o'clock time period of sorts. And uh, normally I don't get actually up out of bed until like 7.15. That's when like I, I should be getting up. But the 7.15 to 7.30 is like where I'm like actually moving from bed to floor. Uh, which is usually not a good sign because I still want to shower. Coffee this morning. Already got to go. Uh, I'm just trying not to dirty, dirty up more coffee cups because then I have to wash them. And as much as I like doing dishes, which I don't, uh, yeah. <laughs> so I hope everyone's doing great today. Uh, normal day yesterday. Actually, it was really slow. Work was like slow. Uh, this is one of those things. So I hung out at work for, I don't know, four hours, four or five hours. And I worked on a couple of draw, like, a couple of upcoming things. That we've been like fiddling with. I just continued to work on those. And then came home and just waited for emails. We were supposed to get one uh, from I don't, the company. Like the person we get our emails from. They had to ask someone else another question about another thing. Uh, so we were playing like the waiting game. And currently still are. So that's that's the thing. But it is what it is. And then let's see what else I do yesterday. Uh, me and my wife hung out a lot. We went. We had to go find a post office. That's not the one beside my work because we had to turn in our keys to our old landlord, mailed those off, they're shipped out, uh, which is good. Then we watched, we cooked dinner together and watched The First Kingsman. We rented it on YouTube for like four bucks, which is pretty expensive for renting a movie, but it saved us from having to go back out. And we have the second movie, but not the first, which is a weird, like, weird thing. Like, why did we buy the second one and not the first one? So... It's one of those things. But, yeah, we watched that and just hung out because yesterday was our, like, day off of streaming and stuff. So, you know, we did a couple other things, like picked up the house a little bit, threw the dishes in, threw a little clothes in, like the simple stuff. But we didn't, like, you know, stream or we didn't go to the gym. We just kind of hung out together because we've been so go, go, go that it's nice just to take, like, a little bit of a slowdown. Anyway, got to go to work. I have nothing planned at work, so... We'll see how that goes. Hopefully, my PE will be in the day, and we can figure out, you know, what's going on with these two jobs that we have. We've had lined up for, like, in the queue, doing, like, working on, but we need more information about. So, that's going to be my day. I don't have nothing else really exciting to talk about. Uh, i trying to think. There's a stream tonight, which is important to say. Uh, 7 o'clock for Monster Hunter World. Nicole will be back up there. She is very quickly running through. Uh, I was ahead of her in hours played. And I think I'm at like 3 now. And she's at like 12. So. What can you do? And I will, since she'll be streaming, I'll probably be maybe d and I've been setting up backstories with people. And I gotta do some like Session Zero, as it would be called. Uh, set up where you meet with one or two people and really discuss their backstory and uh, that kind of thing. Which I actually might send a Discord message to someone today and talk about when I can meet with them. So that's the thing. But that's about it. I mean, with, you know, it being, what is it, a Thursday? Wednesday? Thursday. Dang, week's almost over. Uh, it's the middle of the week, so nothing's exciting going on. I don't have anything, we don't have anything currently planned for this weekend. Um, so, oh, I can not talk about, I, I've been, we've been looking at houses, like, looking at houses. We still need to do a lot of saving, so it's not like we're going to get to buy one anytime really soon, but I still like looking and seeing, because the price range we look at is like, I don't know, 180000 to like 300000 Um, That's kind of like the range I look at. More towards like the lower, like the two hundred thousand would be better. But I have mine, like my app set all the way up to three hundred, just because once you get like there's like a threshold between like 
220 to like 260 where there's some really good houses and 300 just like yeah they're nice but at that point you have to have we'll have such a high mortgage that it'll be not very fun but uh i found one yesterday that i really liked you can find them like sometimes you either find the ones you really like that have awesome like interiors interesting looks on the house you know uh craftsman style or you know whatever it might be um but then maybe the lot's too small uh a lot of places around here are subdivisions and while i don't really have a problem per se with the subdivision um just depends if the subdivision has like a nice lot uh to itself usually i like a fenced in lot um and a nice backyard because eventually me and my wife would like to have kids so you know to have somewhere for them to hang out and play and all that kind of jazz and then i'm trying to think what else um so either they have so lots are hard um getting the right amount of bedrooms uh we would like three bedrooms uh, in the, like a, I guess you'd call it a bonus room, a loft, uh, den or something like that. Or four bedrooms, because uh, we would do three living space bedrooms, like bedroom, be typical bedrooms. And then we need an office. Uh, since we've been enjoying streaming and such, we would like to move that into its own room when we move. Uh, I, we put we had offices in the dining room or any of that. But we'd like to keep a formal dining. Uh, Kate really don't want to really set it up in the living room, because our desk is... I don't know, seven feet, six, seven feet, something like that. So we don't really want to take up that much space in the living room. So we'd like its own room. That way we also could set up like acoustic panels. We could do a little bit more on the side of decorating. Like here we have a few things, but not a lot of things. So that's kind of the ideas. But yeah, I found one yesterday that was so close. A lot was really nice. They gave you an acre lot, which is, you know, not bad for like, you know, first house kind of things. Uh, but it's one room short and as much as i would like to you know say we don't need that extra room if we eventually want like i'm thinking two kids two kids is a good number for me um you need like two bedrooms or if you did one you may be a guest bedroom i don't know so but it's on the like the lower end of the scale on price wise we've not actually looked at it uh the square footage is pretty low it's actually not much more than the apartment we're in so that's another thing that's kind of shaky i would like a little bit more space but the lot it's on is really nice it's an acre of land uh it's got a shed which i think will be nice to get some of the crap out of here into another space like our our closet and our guest bedroom is uh incredibly full so but that's one of the things i did just do you have done did yesterday is i found that one house I, I look at houses about every day. I get notifications, be like, hey, this new house is out. Look at it. It's good. I'll save it. If not, I'll... Pfft. Which, I can't do anything. It'll just exist there. I wish you could, like, click on it and say, I'm not interested. And it wouldn't come up, but you can't. Anyways, guys, I'm going to wrap this thing up. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, there's a like button. You can hit it. Uh, subscribe if you'd like to see more. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.